Jack, how is it that you're not already taken? You're such a wonderful, caring guy. Good looking, muscular, sweet. The ladies should be swarming all over you. Whoa, bro, I'm getting a little jealous here. And I'm the one with the hot babe on my arm. Go away. <laughs> you know, it just comes with the job. You never know if a beautiful young woman is interested in you. You look too drunk. I'm just trying to charm a beer at the bartender. Speaking of uh, friends, I gotta go back and meet Jack at the office. Demarest? Yeah. And I, I really don't know how to get along with him. He's always got my back. But, you know, I always feel guilty whenever I ask him to do something. Uh, you know, you can't, you can't feel guilty asking somebody like that. I mean, the guy's your best friend. Practically your brother. Just take it easy this week. Stop worrying about others. You do that, we'll call it even. I know things have been hard lately, but I mean, you guys gotta... It's Katie. Is she hurt? Who am I kidding, JD? Helping the helpless. Punishing the scum of the world. I'm bullshitting myself. Where do I get off thinking that I can solve everybody's problems? When did I decide that I should be everybody's goddamn savior? I've known you for ten years. In all that time, I've never seen one ounce of ego from you. You're the most unselfish, unegotistical person I know. All you do is sacrifice for others. You gotta think of all the good people you've helped. People who couldn't help themselves. You gotta remember that. If you need my help, I mean, I'm... No. I need to handle this myself. It's my responsibility. People call me the Fixer. But my name is Victor Jason Simmons. What's your problem?